Hello, this is Vineet. Uh, I'm the CEO and founder of Teleport Me, and I wanted to create a quick tutorial about how to use the split and the twin functionality uh, on teleportme.com. Uh, so the split and twin functionality is really simple. It kind of helps you create a before and after effect on panoramas, which I think is really cool. So you can see I'm kind of sliding the slider and you can see it kind of show the before and after and you can you know move it around and so this is very also very useful for virtual staging so let me show you how, how to get this done very it's very very simple so here i've already set up uh, the virtual tour you would create the virtual tour in the in the way you would create a virtual tour then you would set up you would upload the two panoramas and you would you would probably name them before and after or whatever names you want to to kind of show up on the top end part right here once you do this, you're kind of going to the edit section. Uh, now, in the edit section, the only thing that you need to do is set up the initial position. Um, now, in a lot of softwares, when you're editing or when you're exporting the panorama, you can set up the initial position. And I would recommend that could be the best way to do it so that you have a clear, clear way to do it. If not, you can just use the set initial position uh, to, to kind of get it done and you make sure that the initial positions on both the panoramas before and after are kind of similar. Um, yep, and once that's done, I think that's uh, that's all you need to really take care of. If, you, if you're interested in reducing or increasing the zoom, you can do that too. Uh, and then save it. Once you save it, go to the share option. So here is where you have the options to do what you wanna do, right? So. Uh, one is you can add a thumbnail, so you can select a before and after. Generally, I do the after. Um, and then you can do, go to the link, you get the link right here, you copy the link. And once you get the copy link, all you need to do is you need to either add a sp slash split, so we have added right here, and it will split the screen like this right or you add a slash twin and twin is just another way to have two different panorama side by side so yeah i mean that's uh, so you have two panorama side by side and you can kind of like uh, make sure to see what you want they kind of scroll together um, and again the initial position can be set uh, in the editing scene so this way you don't have to really worry about it so this is twin and uh, split is a little different. I, I personally like split a lot. You can see. With split, it's easier to kind of just see the before and after, and, and it's really, really cool. Um, now, there is also the embed option, so you can embed this into your website. So the way you do it is you go to the embed code right here. You copy the embed code and you would paste it just the way you would paste any other embed code, but you would have to change the URL. So I'm going to show you what exactly that, what I mean by that. So now this is me copy pasting the embed code that I copied from here. I copied it from here and I'm adding it here. And now I'm going to just kind of test it to see how it looks. So this looks like any other virtual tour would look like it's got the bottom boxes right here. Uh, now I want to convert this into a split view. So what I do is I, I, I copy this URL that is the split one, teleportme.com slash virtual tour slash, you know, the number, the ID, virtual tour ID and slash split, like the way I showed it to you, I copy it. And then I go here. So under this, you have under the, the, uh, the quotes, you have a URL. So all I do is I replace that URL with the split URL and that's it. And then when you test it, the embed will have this one. Now I, and if I want the twin, I can go back there and just change the twin and I'm oh, sorry. And then that's it. So now you get the twin. Uh, so yeah, that's the only thing that you have to do is just replace that HTML code and, and it goes into 
uh, into all the websites. And uh, if you want to know more, go to blog.teleportme.com. And I have I've written uh, an entire tutorial about it. Uh, you can read how to use it. Um, there are examples of it right here. And uh, yeah, I think that's uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, this tutorial. And if you have any questions, uh, please feel to reach feel free to reach out to me at support at teleportme.com. Uh, see you somewhere else.